Hello everyone, welcome back and welcome if you're new here. My name is Brogan and I do lots of lifestyle, travel and weekly vlogs here on my channel. So please subscribe if you're not already. Today's video is gonna be a girls night in. So pretty much what it says on the tin, I'm hosting my girlfriends for a night in. We're having a sleepover. I'm so excited. There's gonna be wine, games, pizza. We even have a hot tub, right? We are staying in an Airbnb, not far from my house. It's just on the outskirts of the new forest and the girls are buzzing. I did originally had good intentions to hopefully host it at my new house. I am currently in a transition period. If you haven't kept up with my weekly vlogs, I'm moving out of this house, um, which is my boyfriend's family house. And we've bought a house that we're renovating, but sadly it's not quite ready. And I've had this booked in for a while. And instead of canceling, the girls suggested that that we um, get an Airbnb. So that's what we've done. It's absolutely gorgeous. So I've been looking forward to this for so long. I've got my lovely friend Beth coming down from London and then my other girlfriends, Megan, Georgie and Charlotte are joining too. So it's gonna be five of us. And this video is actually very kindly sponsored by Big Potato Games. If you have stuck around and you um, watch my videos regularly, you'll know that I'm a brand ambassador for the company. I love them. I think they're awesome. I know I'm biased, but I'm very proud to have been a brand ambassador the last two years and it's such an honor to say that my job is to share what they do to you guys so I'm gonna be playing three of the games with the girls today in this video so it's really nice to be able to see the games in action and really appreciate them some of you might have seen some of these games before uh, and give you some great ideas for Christmas presents or if you're going to visit family this Christmas and you want to bring a game everyone can play these ones are pretty perfect so I've got a good selection so first of all is Santa Banta I love the fact it's quite small easy to pack it's light we normally go skiing and we go away so for us um we need games that are light and easy to travel with it's a party game with like a rhyming twist um it's so much fun if you've ever played a Barma llama it's basically the same game but christmas themed so christmas rhyming there's charades and there's pairing it's just so much fun christmas time mistletoe and rhyme so this one is such a great perfect gift for this time of year stocking filler as well or if you're doing secret santa at work age 12 plus and you can have four players upwards so that's Santa Banta. Next we have 20 Second Showdown, as you can see. And here, this one is a little noisy. It's got a timer in it. Two teams, quick fire challenges, no time to lose. Age 10 plus, and you can have between five and 20 players. So this one is great if there is a big group of you, like a family. Um, you pass the baton between your team and you get asked to do kind of fun, silly things. So for example, um, blow something off the table, arrange your te team into height order, shout out three types of yellow food, and you've got to think on the spot and it does create some very strange answers so I do love 20 second showdown and last but not least we're going to be playing color brain uh, if you saw my Disney themed party I hosted here back in the summer we played the Disney version of color brain um, but we thought we'd play the normal one this time to show you how awesome this is a lot of the girls love color brain and I actually have um, a copy of the Disney one in the goodie bags I've done for them I know how fun I've done goodie bags I am um, really getting into like being a hostess and every time I do these I you get more creative and think of more things but anyway color brain is about uh you get a question so the color of the lid of a jar of marmite and you get a handful of colors in your hand and you have to guess what you think that answer is it's really easy it's quite nice at the end of the evening when you've all had a couple of drinks and you just want something like easy to play and doesn't involve too much brain power um it's really really fun so we're gonna be playing that as well so yeah, I will leave all the links below for you. I have a discount code, which is BROGAN20, that gets you 20% off all their games on Amazon. So the perfect time to use it, because that will end at the end of this year. So um, if you're interested, definitely jump on that. And thank you so much to Big Potato for allowing me to do these fun things. It is so awesome that I can host all my girls today. And this is the first time I've had them all together. Not all of them, I'm missing a few sadly, but five of us together. Uh, I love them all very much. Normally I hang out with them individually. So it's really sweet that they're all coming together um, to have a girls night with me. And we're all gonna sleep over and have wine and it's gonna be great. So let's do the day. I'm excited. So I've got the goodie bags in here. Big Potato kindly gave us some tote bags. And I might as well show you actually, I've just popped a couple of bits in. So this is their goodie bag. They've got the tote bag. They've got a little Big Potato plushie, Disney color brain, Mr. Lister, like small version, quiz shootout. This is such a good game as well. This is one of my favorites, it's well underrated. 
a couple of pens and stationery bits, some socks, and some fun things I found. So I think we're going to do face masks later, although I do have loads of them, but I put them in there. Goodie bags too. I thought this would be really fun just to say thank you for coming. Also got some like plates, and I've got a sign that I'm going to put up. Welcome, Big Potato Games girls. Oh no, the L is missing. Oh no. <laughs> and then over here, I've started gathering a couple of other bits. I, it's an Airbnb, so I didn't want to bring um. Uh, actual candles so I have these like little light up one battery operated ones oh well that's a great start isn't it <laughs> oh there we go there we go <laughs> so I'm gonna use those and I've got us wine and chocolate and I also have some bits in the fridge as well but we are going to be ordering pizza like takeaway tonight um, but I do need to get some diet coke and some crisps and things like that and just in case you're wondering why I'm not hosting it here that is because my lounge looks a little bit like this <laughs> I'm packing right now, so everything is everywhere. Look, I've got washing here. Not ideal, but it is what it is. I'm so excited actually to have a little night away. So I have had to pack an overnight bag as well. So I'm just getting that together, but we are gonna pop back here first before we um, head on over to the Airbnb. So I can grab all this stuff later. Just arrived at one train station, picking up my friend Beth, who has come down from London. I'm so excited. She's never come and stayed with me before. So I'm gonna show her my new house and my current house. And I wish we had more time because um, it would have been nice to have taken all around Bournemouth as well, but um, she'll stay with me in the new year. But yeah, I come here regularly. So it's weird to be picking up someone though and not actually going to London for once. Beth's with me now. I can't get my seatbelt seat seat on. on. We have driven down to, well, we've been to the new house, seen that. Mm -hmm. And we've been down to Home Bargains to get the stuff we need. And I forgot my purse. <laughs> Here we go. Home Bargains. Got a trolley. You know I'm taking it seriously when I've got a trolley. <laughs> We're doing really well so far. <laughs> Pepsi and some white Twix. Good. You know the highlight of the frozen biscuits. Frozen biscuits, yeah. Good. All right, let's keep going then. We are having a quick stop for lunch. We've done all our food shopping. I'm really tired. Are you? Should we have a nap later? <laughs> I'm not 100% sure how we have so much stuff between two people, but in our defense, <laughs> <laughs> there is a lot of food and games and, you know, we've got I'm, Christmas presents for each other too. I'm looking at the amount of like, Disney bags we've got. <laughs> Disney, Disney, Lion King, Disney, Walt Disney World, Disney, <laughs> Frozen. <laughs> You can tell what we like. We've got to sort these things into kitchen, lounge, Bedroom. bedrooms, and then we're going to start decorating and stuff. We bought some really fun things in Home Bargains, also known as this, and a party sign. So we'll see what it looks like, but should we give them a, we'll do this and then we'll give them a tour. Okay, let's go. We're just on the outskirts of the New Forest in kind of almost on the edge of Ringwood. And it's lovely, like the grounds are insane. Such a perfect fit for us. So I'm gonna give you a really quick tour. Let's go. Front door, so this is when you come in. Spin round, here's the, uh, I guess, hallway. <laughs> this is actually, the owners have the other half of the house, which is insane, so they're down there. Bathroom around the corner, lovely, lovely, lovely. In fact, I'll come through here first. We've got a conservatory, which is nice, although I don't think we're gonna be coming in here whatsoever. Can you imagine just like, reading in here and looking out into your garden this is absolutely gorgeous they've got horses and stables all around the back and they have a swimming pool and a hot tub but i'll show you that side from the other room this is going to be where we spend most of our evening so we've popped a couple of our own bits in here so we got these in home bargains and we've got our christmas gifts to each other our games on the table and i just thought it'd be really nice and sociable and cozy through to the kitchen absolutely gorgeous and beth has put out some of our snacks and food that we picked up. Beth has also stocked up our fridge, so we've got J2O's and Pepsi Max for anyone that doesn't want to drink. And then we have plenty of wine, some salad bits, and all the things I picked up in Sainsbury's. So I have like um, a tapas tray and coleslaw and little mini sausages. And then through here is another bedroom, and this is gorgeous. So one of the girls will be sleeping here, and we have three more bedrooms upstairs. This can accommodate so many, it's amazing. And then we're gonna go in the hot tub when it's not raining. It's kind of stopped raining at the moment, actually. Beth and I could go in if we wanted. I'm just going upstairs, show them the, the, the bedrooms. So this is Beth's one, which we've said is absolutely perfect because it's got little Winnie the Pooh quotes. Look at this. That one says, some paths are destined to cross. Oh, that's so sweet. That's awesome. And it is, isn't it? And this one says, today is my new favorite day. Look at this view. I'd love to wake up and see this. Gotcha. Absolutely gorgeous. Peaceful. Yeah, so you've got a nice little Little single rep bed. Uh, again, that's the other wing of the house. <laughs> this is my bed. 
cozy, happy with this. This is obviously like the master bedroom and it's massive. And then there's a bathroom in here and massive bath like that. So it's about three o'clock, I think. It's about three, yep, five past three. Oh, the Airbnb owner just said, lovely, thanks Brig, and have a lovely time. Thank you so much. Right, we've got the fire going. Everything's kind of ready and I'm so excited. I just can't wait to have all my girlfriends together and it's so perfect and everyone's gonna be so comfortable and everyone's gonna have a bedroom and I'm really looking forward to it. It just feels like I've had a little mini break away, you know, like a little weekend away. So Georgie's here, Charlotte's on her way, Megan's gonna be about half an hour. We're going to cook pizzas because we realized that there wasn't any way to get a delivery down here. So we ended up having to go to Waitrose, pick up some pizzas, and we're gonna cook those and then we'll eat and then show you us playing games. We'll just get everyone to know each other first and then um, we'll show you the games. And then drink some wine, yeah. I love the fact that there's YouTube tutorials. This in German, what colour is rot? Right, so you live in German no. school. Yay! So we basically have known it. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. It rolls over. Yeah, it rolls over. Oh. The Oompa Loompas wigs from the 1971 That's version that. of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Yeah. 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 It's either that or that. Oh, I know. Yeah, it's that one. Yeah, because they are. They are. Yeah. That, I think. Ready? What do you think? Ready? Oh. Yay! Okay. We're just saying. Oh. Oh. Yeah. I love that we're all in our PJs. They're all in their PJs. Okay. Are we doing three? Ready? Okay. Oh, they're so different. So different. <laughs> what is it? Oh! oh well well done. <laughs> Excuse me, we'd like to play a card steal, and so you need to uh, put your cards. Yeah, and we are allowed to take four, one round, and we can play this once, I believe. Yeah. Every color of you say, and I go down. Yeah, sure. I don't doubt she's good at this game. No, no, <laughs> really? I'm not you sure? Come on, right this here. is the winning card. Come on then. Yeah. Oh, we both got it. Okay, right, we've got to go again then. I think it's what you said. Yeah. In there, it's that one. Oh, that one. Yeah. Well done. That was a good round. That was very good. Next up, we're on Santa Banta. This is a really great game. So we can be in two teams again. Essentially, you've got three rounds. Describe it, solve it where you read off a rhyme, and this one is charades. And then once you get up to here, so you guys, charade, charades, you're wrong. <laughs> right, Megan, you've won, so you can have a chance at trying to find a pair. We need to remember, you've got good memory. Have you got good memory? So she's obviously not gonna get one on the first round, I mean. Oh. No, she did. Oh my god, she did. Turkey Rose Christmas Ghost. So you get a pe keep a pair. I mean, that was that was well lucky. You get to go again. <laughs> Sorry, I take that back. Jeez. Wow, I didn't know that you were uh, Mystic Meg. Yeah, right. I feel like he's up here. Oh no. Okay. Keith is it from Keith. Keith. So they'll be the colours. So try and remember. We've got light blue there, green, green there. Okay, blue. right, okay. So next but round then. Them over. I don't know what you're doing. In the box. Eggnog. Frog! 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 Eggnog. Eating a log. Oh god! Oh my god, this one's so funny. An old man who you're related to. Uncle? Dad. 
Relatives, old uncle, dad, granddad, old dad, granddad, <laughs> um, granddad on the on the snip. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> what was it? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Roast potatoes. Think of the rhyme. Roast potatoes. Potatoes. Yeah. Potatoes. Potatoes. Having a dough. Yeah. Potatoes. Oh, well, pieces of potatoes. Oh, well done. That was hard. To yeah, be that fair. was hard. So it's lump of coal. And you have to try and shiraz, no talking. Cold. Ready, go. I. Glasses. Come on, rhyme it, rhyme it. Looking. Say it. Key. Key. Door. Key. <laughs> Come on, lump of coal. Coal, what rhymes with coal? Lump of coal. Lump of coal is a hole. Lump of coal in your keyhole. Christmas socks. Uh, Christmas socks. <laughs> what is that? What is she doing? Okay, pass. Christmas socks. Locks. Picking locks. Picking locks. Yeah. yeah. Christmas socks. Oh my goodness, I don't know it. <laughs> I know this one. Jack in the box. Oh. Um. <laughs> Six pack. Yeah. Santa's sack. Eating a snack. Santa's sack. I'm not meant to say anything. So we're on 20 second showdown now. We have this little, what do you want to call it? Timer. timer. Egg timer. We need to put it in the middle, don't we? I think. Oh yeah. Is that right? <laughs> what did you oh, shit. Yeah. What's that? <laughs> so, oh, one, two, three, four, and turn around. What? No, turn, there you go. Turn. Oh, oh. There you go. Name three animals whose milk you can drink. Cows, goats, sheep. Yeah. because I get, I love the like different things in it, but they're all good. They're all really good. They're all things. really good. Santa in different Banta ways. Good. I've, I laugh so hard my belly hurts. Yeah, yeah. to be it's fair, so good. Yeah. I feel no. like, I feel like I've been out. I'm exhausted. I'm, exhausted. <laughs> so I'm like colour brain's my favourite. Yeah. I do, Georgie was really good at colour brain. She's gone to bed, bless her, because she's got work in the morning. But she was so good at that. She was so good. Yeah. So we're gonna go and get in the hot tub now. I think. Yeah. I'm really hot. I'm kind of like, I can't imagine getting it on top. Yeah, what time is it? It's True. It's five to midnight. Good, yeah, let's go. We're going in the hot tub, but it's raining. I left mine on bed. I think I'm going to have to. Yeah, I'm going to have to leave mine in here. Good morning. It is Saturday. It's half past eight, 20 to nine. And I am going to jump in the hot tub because I don't often get the chance to go in a hot tub. Actually, the last time I was in one was when I was on the Isle of Wight in September. So, but you know what I mean, it's quite a novelty. So, 
gonna jump in just for like 10 15 minutes then shower have breakfast pack up morning <laughs> What a time to be alive. We're at the train station, about to go home. Well, best about to go yeah. back to London. And I'm about to go back home home. We tidied up, we had some croissants. It was just so fun, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, really it was just so nice. I was just saying to Beth, like all the love in the room with all my friends, like all the feels. it was so good. <laughs> the dynamics were so fun. I had such a good time. Did you have fun? Yeah. yeah, I'm so tired. So don't blame me. We went to bed at 3 a.m. We are in the hot tub. Until 2.30, didn't we? And yeah. then we went to bed at 3. Oh, well, it was about 2, 2, 2.30ish, but... The hot tub was the mad. dream, to be honest. It was nice, wasn't it? It was worth it. Yeah. So good. So, yeah, that's pretty much the end of this video, to be honest. Thank you so much to Big Potato Games for sponsoring. If you want to go and check out their games, I will leave them linked below for you. I've also written a blog post on all of my... Um, favorite games and ones that I would uh, like recommend for big parties or smaller like couples and travels so if you want to check that out I'll leave that below for you and don't forget my discount code is brogan20 um, which is valid until the end of the year so it's perfect time to use it for Christmas gifts and stuff like that so yeah I'm gonna carry on my day carry on weekly vlogging on the other vlog and um, thank you for coming down for coming thanks for having me have you back soon <laughs> yeah, definitely. and um, yeah we'll see you very soon bye <laughs> <laughs>